I am pleased to introduce the speakers in uh, Sadovnice uh, and Artyom Savchuk uh, with the talk on the operator group uh, generated by the one dimensional direct system. Please, you can start. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, first of all, I want to uh, uh, thank some. Uh, thanks uh, uh, the organizers of this uh, conference uh, for the opportunity to have a talk here. Uh, this is uh, a first uh, time we, uh, I was in the Sadovniche participating in this conference. Uh, many thanks for, uh, uh, for the opportunity. And uh, our talk is uh, about the one dimensional Dirac system. Let me start. Here it is. Uh, we consider uh, the differential expression, uh, ordinary differential expression uh, of first order uh, in the space uh, of uh, two component functions uh, uh, with uh, summable in square with L2. Uh, for uh, every component. And uh, we consider only the finite segment, zero pi. Uh, of course, uh, the Dirac operator uh, is, uh, uh, it is possible to consider uh, on the half line or in the whole line, uh, but we, uh, will speak only uh, on the uh, finite segment. Uh, uh, you see here the matrix B of coefficients. Uh, and uh, uh, there are two uh, forms of uh, Dirac system. Uh, one with uh, this uh, matrix and another with matrix zero, one, minus one, zero. Uh, the one can be uh, turned to another by uh, direct substitution. Uh, this is very uh, common. And uh, uh, we consider uh, the direct system with potential P and uh, the main, our goal is to consider non-continuous potentials. Uh, we uh, uh, will co uh, we'll consider only summable uh, functions P. Uh, here you see boundary conditions. Uh, the boundary conditions uh, are uh, of the general type, the general type. And uh, this is the, uh, uh, definition of Birkhoff regularity of boundary conditions uh, for this case, for the case of this system, uh, it is uh, that uh, two determinants uh, combined on first and fourth and uh, of second and third uh, rows of uh, this matrix are uh, not uh, equal to zero, not vanished. Uh, This is the domain of our operator, uh, absolutely, absolutely continuous functions uh, and uh, boundary conditions. Uh, I already said that uh, the potential is uh, only summable and uh, is complex valued. Uh, in the classical theory, the potential assumed to be continuous. Uh, it is uh, not uh, very hard to see that the diagonal elements of potential uh, can be eliminated uh, by the uh, common substitution. Ah, th this is the uh, second uh, form of a Dirac operator with another matrix. We can turn uh, one uh, form to another uh, and I want to say about the uh, substitution which uh, eliminated uh, ah, 
Uh, no, no. Uh, it is on another slide. Uh, uh, I want to say that uh, the classical boundary conditions uh, in this form uh, uh, looks uh, not in the usual uh, as usual. For example, uh, Dirichlet boundary conditions are this, uh, uh, the following. Uh, you can see it. And so uh, let uh, I uh, say uh, uh, something about uh, uh, bibliography. Uh, the classical case is the case of continuous potential. And the first is that on summable potential uh, are results of Greenif, Mikituk, and Sergio Alberio. Uh, then uh, many, uh, uh, many researchers uh, studied this case, uh, risk basicity of eigenvalues, uh, eigenfunctions and associated functions. Uh, by Trushin and Yamamoto, they considered uh, continuous and moreover uh, this uh, class of potentials, C1, with separated boundary conditions. Then uh, Jakov and Mityagin and Baskakov, Derbyshev, Sherbakov considered the case of uh, potential in L2 with separated boundary conditions, and Savchuk Shkalikov uh, and independently Malamut and Lunyov consider uh, summable potentials uh, with any strictly regular boundary conditions, and then we consider the case of general regular boundary conditions. Uh, <clears throat> Uh, many properties uh, were investigated of uh, this uh, Dirac system, for example, Barry Marcus property uh, for his projections. Uh, Jakov and Mityagin studied periodic and anti-periodic boundary conditions. Uh, there are two uh, uh, interesting reviews of, of this theme uh, and uh, some words about uh, Dirac type n times n systems. Uh, they are uh, also studied. And uh, now we uh, want to talk about uh, an operator group. Uh, an operator group uh, with uh, generator uh, L, operator, Dirac operator, uh, uh, with uh, coefficients i. Uh, uh, in other words, we consider dynamic equation this is this equation, and uh, we prove the uh, theorem of uh, existence of uh, this uh, group uh, in the space H, and also in the scale of uh, Sobolev spaces uh, with uh, parameter of sharpness theta uh, and uh, with uh, boundary conditions. Uh, for theta uh, less than uh, one uh, half, these uh, spaces uh, coincide to classical Bessel, uh, spaces of Bessel potentials. Uh, we also prove the existence of uh, operator group in uh, space L mu with parameter mu from one to infinity. And this is uh, more uh, more interesting result, um, uh, as we think. Uh, and also, we obtain estimates for this uh, uh, group. Uh, this is very common estimate. Uh, the theorem uh, is that we can uh, estimate this parameter beta uh, for the case of Sobolev spaces, uh, this is, uh, uh, we can choose the parameter as uh, this. And in the spaces L mu, uh, in any case, uh, we can claim that beta depends only on the norm of potential, but not only uh, on 
potential P on the norm. This is our main results. Uh, so uh, it is easy to see that uh, we can consider only the case of uh, of diagonal potentials with P1 and P4 uh, equals to zero. Uh, we can uh, transform uh, any Dirac operator to this form um, and uh, our theorem is that uh, the Dirac operator is similar to uh, Dirac operator with uh, of diagonal potentials, potential and uh, some other boundary conditions. Uh, this is explicit formulas. Uh, and uh, these boundary conditions uh, also can be uh, write it down explicitly. And uh, this is a, a transformation operator M. Uh, this operator is bounded in uh, any space H or H theta, H theta U uh, with any theta and in spaces L mu for any mu. Uh, so uh, from uh, this slide, let me uh, will speak only on uh, of diagonal potentials. And so our potential have the following form. Uh, uh, first of all, some uh, preliminary results uh, on uh, Dirac operator. Uh, uh, let me consider the Dirac operator with zero potential. This is very simple uh, case. Uh, the, uh, however, some operator uh, not can cannot be. Um, uh, the eigenvalues and eigenfunctions of some operator cannot be uh, evaluated explicitly uh, because the boundary conditions U uh, uh, can be some uh, complicated. Uh, but in any case, the spectrum of this operator uh, is purely discrete uh, and eigenvalues forms uh, two series, two series. Uh, the spectrum lie in a some uh, strip, a horizontal strip uh, in a complex domain. Uh, we will enumerate these eigenvalues uh, with index n. Uh, so we get uh, one series of eigenvalues. Uh, This uh, is the definition of strongly regular uh, boundary conditions. Uh, in case uh, this uh, discriminant, the discriminant of this uh, quadratic equation is equal to zero, uh, then uh, all the eigenvalues uh, have uh, this multiplicity two. And if uh, the uh, discriminant is not equal to zero, then they are all simple, and uh, we call this case strongly regular. Uh, another uh, very interesting theorem, uh, the theorem uh, uh, of me and uh, Andrei Shkalikov, uh, any regular Dirac operator uh, can be represented uh, with of diagonal potential uh, can be represented as a sum of uh, some operator A and uh, operator V, where uh, operator A is unbounded closed operator on a dense domain uh, with compact uh, resolvent, and uh, operator V uh, is a bounded and moreover uh, it is uh, a compact operator. So uh, we uh, can uh, claim that uh, any Dirac operator uh, is uh, a, a perturbation of some uh, good operator A. The spectrum of A 
consist uh, of the eigenvalues, uh, then they can be numbered as follows. Uh, this is, uh, uh, this term is uh, some uh, constant when n is uh, even or and another constant uh, in case n is odd. And the geometric and algebraic multiplicities of the eigenvalues coincide. Uh, operator A has no associated functions. And uh, the main result uh, of uh, our uh, the result of Shkalikov and Savchuk, uh, the system uh, of this operator A forms a risk basis in, this, uh, in our space uh, for any summable potential P and any uh, strict, uh, strictly regular uh, boundary conditions. Uh, I already said that the operator V uh, is bounded and moreover, uh, if the boundary conditions are strongly regular, then it operator can be taken uh, uh, to be finite dimensional. Uh, Thus, uh, in virtue, uh, by virtue of this uh, theorem, uh, the operator E A or E uh, I uh, L uh, generates a uh, continuous group in our space. Uh, this is our uh, theorem for the operator, uh, the Dirac operator generates a continuous group in the space H. Uh, uh, as long as we have uh, a risk basis property uh, of a uh, system of eigenvalues and associate, uh, eigenfunctions and associated functions, uh, we can write uh, the, this group explicitly uh, in the Fourier series. Uh, here, uh, why? Uh, are eigen and associated functions and that are the orthogonal system. Uh, this system is uh, eigen and associated functions of a joint operator. And uh, this is the estimation of, uh, of the norm of our group uh, where beta is the following uh, and C uh, the constant C uh, turns uh, from the uh, Ries uh, basis property of the system Y and Z. This is the Ries constant, so-called Ries, uh, the, uh, the so-called Ries constant of these uh, systems. Uh, another result is uh, that. Uh, the operator, which uh, turns some autonormal basis to our uh, uh, system of uh, eigen and associated functions, uh, is continuous, and uh, uh, we have this estimation. And then we can uh, say that uh, the constant in our estimate uh, depends only on the norm of potential and on the boundary condition, of course. Uh, a result uh, was proved by uh, Savchuk and Sadovniche and independently uh, by Lunyov and Malamud. Uh, some words about uh, the Sobolev spaces, the scale of spaces, uh, H uh, theta. Uh, this is, uh, uh, simple results which uh, are following from the uh, previous theorem. Uh, let me consider the space H1, uh, then uh, it is uh, very simple. We uh, see that uh, the resolvent is an isomorphism. Uh, the, this operator is an isomorphism from H to H1. Uh, so, uh, our group is well-defined in the space H1. 
one, and then uh, we use an interpolation theorem, complex interpolation between this uh, pair of spaces, and obtain the result of uh, existence of our uh, group in uh, the uh, whole scale. Uh, more, uh, more complicated and more interesting results uh, we obtain uh, for uh, the spaces L mu, uh, for mu not equal to, uh, for not Hilbert space, uh, for not Hilbert uh, case. Uh, here uh, we have only a conditional basis property for our system instead of free basicity. This is the result of Sadovnice. Uh, so we cannot determine uh, our group as uh, Fourier series. Uh, uh, our attempts to, uh, to use uh, Hill-Eacida theorem uh, was not successful. Uh, we don't know any any qualities, uh, any estimates for uh, the uh, case degree of resolvent. Uh, uh, there is an interesting uh, Gamilka theorem. Uh, this is sufficient condition for Banach spaces and a criteria a criterion for Hilbert case. Uh, uh, if uh, the uh, ah, here is the degree minus one here uh, should be uh, uh, inverse operator here. Uh, this is uh, 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 integral of uh, resolvent. Uh, if uh, uh, we have some, uh, this estimation, then the se the semi group and in our case uh, our group uh, is uh, well defined. But uh, we don't do not know uh, is their estimation uh, valid. Uh, we think that it is not fulfilled in, in this case. So uh, 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 but we succeeded to uh, prove that uh, even in this case, uh, Operator group is well defined for any uh, space L mu uh, except one and infinity. Uh, and uh, also, we proved uh, the estimation for uh, norm of our group uh, where uh, B, uh, here the constant B is uh, interesting, uh, depends also only on the norm of potential, only on the norm of our potential. Uh, of, uh, we published this uh, theorem uh, only for periodic boundary conditions. Uh, some what's about the idea of our proof. Uh, the idea is to use the transformation operator. Uh, the theory of transformation operators for sturm will or for Dirac uh, is uh, a common theory, uh, but not in case of uh, summable uh, coefficients for Dirac system or uh, for uh, distributional potential. Uh, but uh, uh, there are uh, results uh, f f uh, of Greenif and Mikituk. Uh, this is uh, the transformation operator. Uh, it transforms uh, the function exponent to uh, the function's uh, solution of uh, our equation with uh, some estimation of uh, these integral kernels. Uh, this is results of Greenev. Uh, this is uh, some results on transformation operators. 
uh, very common results of Gelfand, Levitan, and Marchenko. Uh, then Crane results. Uh, and uh, uh, for our case, it's uh, results of Grenif and Mikituk uh, for Dirac systems. For Dirac system. Uh, we write formal series uh, for our operator group. Uh, and here, uh, y and z and the same. Uh, uh, and then use uh, our transformation operator and uh, we apply a very interesting theorem of Rostislav Grinev. Uh, you see uh, the eigenvalues of uh, Dirac operator uh, are not only n plus something uh, something with, uh, which turns to zero. No, uh, this is uh, uh, a Fourier coefficient of uh, some function uh, p. Uh, it, this function is determined by the potential. And if our potential uh, belongs to L uh, kappa or, or L mu, then uh, this is Fourier coefficient of the function of L mu function. Uh, and then we can see the sum bounded operator uh, of this form. Uh, and uh, the series uh, converged in a weak sense. No, then further by the standard trick, we obtain strong convergence of the series. And this is idea of uh, the proof of our theorem. Thank you for your attention. Uh, for a very interesting talk. Um, other questions, comments, remarks for the speaker? Please. I have a question, a short question. In the uh, theorem uh, five, uh, the constant B is complex or real? Theorem, theorem five. Uh, no. it, it, B. Uh, constant B, number B. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm, it's real constant, it's real constant, real. real. Positive or negative? <laughs> Uh, positive, in any case, positive, non-negative. <laughs> Thank you. More questions, please? Let us to thank uh, the speaker again for a very interesting talk.